What's good everybody? Welcome back to Cadillac Cartoons and today I'm going to show you how to draw the face at a front view. So let's get started. So as usual when I'm doing a face tutorial I always start out with a basic circle. And then I know it's not perfect and it doesn't have to be so we're just going to keep it just like this for now. And then since we're going to draw the front view of the face, we're going to make a center line, like right down the middle. And here's a trick for you. If you're actually doing it on a notepad like I'm doing here, you can also rest your pinky finger on the edge and get the middle line and then just slide your hand down, making a straight line. And hopefully you can see that. So let me do that again. There you go. And then about three quarters down, uh, from the circle, we're going to draw another center line, so I'm going to make turn my paper so I can do that. And this is where the eyes are going to rest. So I'm going to make this line a little bit, uh, you know, distorted. And it's going to be facing uh, downward. So instead of using this straight line, we're going to use the um, this line that we just drew here. So we can erase this one instead. And then now, we're going to start and draw the face shape. And now the face shape kind of starts where we drew this line on these two ends here. And then we don't want to make it too far down from the head because it's going to look it's going to look weird. And we're going to kind of make the head shape kind of symmetrical, so we're going to make it the same on both sides. And see, that's uh, symmetrical enough for me. And now that we got the face shape all drawn, we can draw the ears in. So the ears are like basic circles or ovals actually. Sort of like an egg shape that's kind of cut off towards the uh, face. And it's going to be, you know, symmetrical again. Before we actually get to drawing the eyes, nose, and mouth and all that stuff, we're going to try to get some symmetry in. So that way when we finalize the entire piece, we won't have to worry about this side being off a little bit and then, you know, it's best to change all this while you're sketching, especially if you're doing it traditionally. And I know the hairstyle isn't really symmetrical, but some hairstyles may require you to go symmetrical, you know, same on both sides, but for this one, I'm just not going to do that. Just because the rest of the face is symmetrical and just to kind of like exaggerate it a little bit. Okay, and then we're going to draw the neck. And so the neck is basically a cylinder, but sometimes I like to manipulate the shape of that. But the majority of the time it is a cylinder. And then just draw in a little shirt. And then now we can get to drawing the actual eyes, nose, and mouth, and all the facial features. So like right in the middle of this, um, this side of the face is where the eyes are going to lie. So not exactly towards where these two lines intersect and not too close to the ear. Because we need space for the nose here, so that's why I'm not going to make it too close to the to the actual center line. And um, also keeping it symmetrical as well. But if you're making face expressions, then it may not be symmetrical. And then I don't want to make an actual nose uh, coming right off the eyes like this. So what I'm going to do instead, I'm going to make a couple guidelines for the nose and then draw it in place and then when I get the nose just right I like to erase all these other guidelines because I want to make the because I'm trying to make the nose kind of you know short I don't want to make it too long on the front view of the face because me personally I don't like the way it looks just getting rid of all these other guidelines and just keeping this shape right here for the nose and then for the mouth what I like to do is making a mouth sort of this shape. Don't give give him a smile, and then a line down here resting on this center line for the chin. Just a little short line like this, and then up here is where we're gonna draw the eyebrows. Uh, I'm not going to apply too much detail, but it's going to be in the same position of the eyes. It's going to be, uh, see this arc right here I drew for the eyes? 
We're gonna sort of make that same arc, except it's gonna be more uh, sort of straight and tapered coming along the um, outer parts of the face. As you can see, if, if it doesn't make sense, then just watch what I'm doing. And then just draw the ears in place, or the ear, the ear lobes, or whatever they're called. Just draw those in place, and then I'm gonna draw the eyes in place. And this is how you draw a face, and, and let me show you how it looks when it's actually inked and colored. So this is what the face looks like all nice and colored and inked and everything. So if you liked today's video and you found it useful, give it a like and a comment. Subscribe if you haven't and tap the notification bell so you never miss an upload. And I'll see you in my next video.